I was gonna say as girl, and I think I'm going to. So like, what's the T behind like the whole M R D M R? M D M R. M D M R. Murder. Yeah. What's what's going on there? Like I'm just I'm lost. Did like, you guys not like them? Yeah. Well, this happened like last year, but we before mm -hmm. we we went to Wu Tang, we were signed to Mandem Records. And um, we weren't treated the best, so we um, we decided to leave them uh -huh. and sign a million dollar deal with Wu Tang Records. And obviously, yeah. they didn't take that very well. So they, um, mm -hmm. I think I don't know who does two first, but um, someone did a diss track. I think it was Sparky, Sparky Kane, that did a diss track on us first, and then mm -hmm. we um, we dissed him back. And then Dwayne okay. dissed us, who was like the owner of Mandem Records, and like Molly Rowland, who was like one of the owners as well. Like, it was just like diss tracks back and forth, and just a big drama. But honestly, it's all funny now because Mandem Records now is just dead. Really? Yeah. Yeah, and we released our song MDMR equals flop. Like, why do you think it's sad? Um, well, because the people that work at the company are more involved with the things going on in their gang, which is Mandem, um, mm -hmm. rather than their own record label. And they just didn't know how to hire people who knew how to run a record label. And like, that was their focus, you know, like they should have hired someone like for that company rather than like someone who has to deal with gang duties as well. I just feel like they just didn't know what they were doing. Okay. And do you think... If they did hire someone that knew how to do it, like, do you think it still, like, it would come back to life? Like, what do you, like... Um, I think that, yeah, I feel like, I mean, anything, you know, can come back to life if you put in the work. I feel like if they mm -hmm. hired the right people to run the company and hired artists and put on events and, like, paid their artists well, then, yeah, I don't see why it couldn't be successful. I mean, they had us, you know? Yeah. Well, the thing is, I was thinking, like, how would it feel if, like, I don't know. If what? You signed to them? Yeah, because I was like, there's, you know, I feel like they were, they're saying they're like, I could be like the queen, you know what I mean? Like a queen, oh. like amongst them, you know what I mean? I kind of like that vibe, you know what I mean? Who, who so I'm like, talking to? Hmm. Um, Black. Do you know Black Boy? Like, you know Blacky Boy? No. Never heard of him. Well, he's an artist there. I don't think he's like management, but I've talked to the management like management team before. Cause I was thinking about like trying to get into it or something. I don't know. I think that I was... if you went over there and you, I feel like you could revive it and you know, be the face of Mandem Records and really rep it. You know, I feel like with mm -hmm. Wu Chang, there is a lot of competition and I was listening to the music, it's so good though. Like this one guy's music there yeah, was I mean, really, they, really they good. Yeah, I mean, they really talented artists, but I feel like it's just the management there that doesn't know how to like really promote them and like really put on events or like, I just feel like yeah. MGMR is kind of a ghost town, but I feel like, you know, you I are- I think I could help. And, yeah, I feel like maybe you could Cause really- Cause I like, yeah. Something. Cause I'm like, if they need someone to help figure things out, like I kind of like, you know, I'm very creative and I have different things and I've made so many like connections and talked to so many people in the city. Like, I feel like yeah. I could figure something out. You know what I mean? I, I don't know. Agree. I feel like you could totally show them how to do things. And maybe, uh, you know, you could even go into like maybe a management position and like, you know, revive the company. Right. That would be You guys want to be mad or anything, right? No, we wouldn't be mad. I think it would okay, be a period. great opportunity for you to like, you know, because at Wu Chang, like I said, there is lots of competition, lots of things going on. There's already kind of a set management, you know, people running things. Mm -hmm. And I feel like at MGMR, you can kind of have like a fresh kind of plate to like build a foundation there. And I feel like you could even like, I would see you in like a management position too there, honestly, if you like are mm -hmm. there long enough and like build things up from the ground. Yeah. And, like, do things. Hi, I'd be down. Well, I don't know You're if I would. Me. I mean, I would like to be a, have a position in management, but I still want to like make music and perform and yeah, stuff. Yeah, like, I mean, yeah, that's what you know, like Liz does and things like that, and yeah. like Noel and Valentine. Yeah. they're like management at Wu Chang, and they are um, 
you know they make oh music. yeah okay yeah i could definitely i that would sound interesting yeah. because i don't really deal with like gang shit like i don't really do any yeah. of that stuff so i wouldn't have like my mind isn't split on like doing things for that like i'm really focused so no i just wanted to like you know Ooh, well that's them. one of the things i wanted to talk to you about yeah i honestly i see a lot of potential for you there yeah, thank you. Um, also, again, congratulations, girl, on your... Well, the performance, A, it was amazing, but also congratulations on, like, the success of the song. Oh, like, it really... Thank you. It was really good. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. I loved it. And I, I love that I inspired you to do those parachutes. You know what I mean? That was really, really great as well, you, you know? Me? Oh, yes. I you know, I did a parachute that. performance in Milan. And, I don't um, think anyone's ever seen that. <laughs> I, no, I, there, there was people that saw. They saw me parachuting, looking oh, very like sucker punch. We flew out of a, see, did any a helicopter. See, did it in like, clearly. Well, I just, I don't think that's a very like. I listen. Idea. I know yeah, you're very you're very humble. I get it. But, I'm um, very humble. Yeah, I'm the most humble person I know. I love that. Um, well, right now I'm. Are you busy? Are you doing something? Um, I'm not too busy. Why? What's up? Oh, well, I'm just, well, I'm in this man's car. He's giving me a nasty little drift test, but um, oh. I could like come through and chill, you know, cause I've been working all day, girl. Like my dogs are barking, girl. I just need to like oh. chill, you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm so down, y'all. Yeah, I'll give you a call and we can hang out or something. Mm-hmm. Okay, period. Text okay. me. Well, I'll save your number. I'll text yeah, you. Yeah, save my number. Okay, period. Okay, I'll see you. See you. Love you. Love you. Bye. Mwah.